Hey everyone, it's time to check out the September comic block. My name is Jake Elliott. I'm the co-host of a podcast called Pop Culture Leftovers. We're a podcast about movies, TV shows, comic books, video games, all that kind of geeky stuff. You can find us on iTunes, find us on Stitcher, wherever you find podcasts, you can find us. Just search for us. We're Pop Culture Leftovers. Now, when I open this comic block, I'm going to rate each individual item the same way we do it on the show. I'm either going to toss it, which means I don't like it, I'm going to taste it, which means I think it's okay, or I'm going to Tupperware it, which means I absolutely love it. So let's check out this comic block. Now, I know I said September. I'm a little bit behind on doing these unboxings, just been busy with stuff, so kind of just fell behind on it. I apologize for that, but let's see what we got. I don't know any spoilers for this comic block. If I knew any, then I've forgotten by now, so it's going to be all surprises. So there's the first look into the box. And let's see what we got going on. All right, let's check out this shirt, if I can unfold it the correct way. Oh, look at that shirt. That is nice. We've got a Saga t-shirt. That is cool. I don't even know if you can buy Saga t-shirts yet. So, yeah, that is a Tupperware. I, I love that. Uh, yeah, Psychotics, a lot of them. All right, that is great. Loving that. So let's move that aside. Oh, the next item we have is a Insta Toss It. It's a uh, Green Lantern light up ring. Um, I'm not the biggest DC fan. I mean, I don't hate it, but I'm a lot more picky about what I like compared to Marvel. And But as far as characters go, Green Lantern is probably my least favorite DC property. It looks like Ryan Reynolds' Green Lantern, too, which is like the worst so it lights up though so yeah big whoop de doo oh man yeah hopefully i can find someone that will want that i'm trying to figure out how to make it light up for you but not having any luck with that so all right let's move on let's move on we've got mad max fury road issue number one yeah i'm gonna actually give that a toss it i um this already came in one of the nerd blocks that I get. So it's like basically because I got the nerd block and the comic block, I'm getting the same comic book twice. I think I may have low tasted it when I first got it in the nerd block, but a, a second issue of a comic I low tasted is definitely a uh, toss it. So probably try to give that away also. All right, let's see what else we got going on. We've got, looks like if I can get it out of here. Danger Girl, number one. I give that a taste it. Um, I was a big Danger Girl fan back in the day. Um, I'm a huge J. Scott Campbell fan. Um, the thing is, is J. Scott Campbell doesn't ever draw Danger Girl anymore. So I kind of fell off of it as soon as he fell off of it. So, but I I'll give it a read. It'll be interesting to read one of these modern Danger Girl comic books. So that's, that's a taste it. And then we've got... Deadpool versus Thanos, number one. All right, I'm going to give this a Tupperware, actually. I'm a huge uh, Tim Seeley fan. Um, he's the writer of Hack Slash, which is a property I really like. So I'm betting that this is going to be a pretty funny book. I've heard a lot of good things about this book, actually. So I'm excited to have my own copy of it and give it a try. Let's uh, check out the art for a quick second in this one and see what it looks like. Pretty decent art. Yeah, I'm excited to give that book a read. So that is a good pull from the old comic block. I'm excited about that. And it looks like there's, usually there's only three comics, but it looks like this one's got four comics. So that's kind of nice. Stepping up their game on the amount of stuff they're giving you. We've got Mirror's Edge, number one. Exordium from Dark Horse Comics. I have no clue what that property is and I've never heard of it. Um, I'm willing to try something new though. I'll give it a low taste it. I'll flip through it and see if it's something I would be interested in maybe picking up the trade later if I like the first issue. Uh, the cover doesn't get me all that excited though. So I, I hope it's better than what it looks like on the cover. Um, we've got a card that tells us all the stuff that we got. So there we go, Prince Robot 4 t-shirt, Deadpool versus Thanos comic, and that's it for the comic block. So we got the uh, 
horrific Green Lantern ring. We've got the uh, Saga t-shirt. And then we've got our four comics this month. So I hope that's a new thing that they're giving us four comics. I guess that makes up for the fact that they gave me a comic that I might already have. So there we go, everyone. Thanks for watching my comic block video. I'm going to keep making more, so keep watching. Bye.